pepperonis that I just cut up into fours as well. So this is gonna be a great snack um, for the kids or for yourself, you know, whatever you decide. I'm just gonna take all of our biscuit dough and put it in our bowl here. Got all those there, okay. And then we're gonna take our pepperoni, sprinkle that in there too. All right, then we're gonna add some olive oil. Uh, this is probably gonna be about a third of a cup of olive oil. We don't wanna like drown it, but we wanna give it a good sprinkle so it's not too sticky. All right, then we're gonna add some basil. You can be generous with your basil. Then we're gonna add some garlic powder. And this is my personal preference. If you do not want garlic powder, you do not have to add it. And then we're gonna add some Italian seasoning. just to give it that nice pizza feel. And then we're gonna add some mozzarella cheese. I would say with the mozzarella, this can be interchangeable with Parmesan if you would prefer that. Um, but I think m mozzarella and pizza just go together in my personal preference. And I'm probably gonna do half of this bag here. Cause, uh, we love, 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 love our cheese. So let me put my gloves on real quick because we're going to get hands on with our snack. If I can get my hands in there, guys. There we go. We're just going to mix all of those ingredients in here real nicely. This smells so good already, and we haven't even started cooking. We want to make sure those pepperonis get everywhere, our cheese get everywhere, seasonings mixed up in there real nicely. Look at that. Doesn't that look good already? <laughs> yep. And our biscuits are buttery, so it's going to have a nice little butter taste to it. And then we're just gonna move this here. And we're gonna make like little pizza balls. I can do a little bit more. Just like that, and we'll set it in there. Your pepperoni might not want to stick, so you might have to grab it yourself to put it in there. Look at that. Oh, this is going to go so well together. And it doesn't take long at all to cook. This one's gonna be extra pepperoni. There we go. And these are gonna form to the muffin pan, so no worries when it comes to that part. There you go. That one's gonna be mine right there. All right, so our last step before we put it in the oven, and you just follow the directions on the uh, Pillsbury dough uh, container. We're just gonna add a dollop or two of this pizza sauce. You can also use like marinara if you want as well. That will work just fine. Mm. 
and you can also wait if you want to add the pizza sauce to when they're almost done cooking or you can make it as like a dipping sauce and get you a little bowl and dip them in at the end. So I got my oven preheated to 350 and we're gonna pop these in there for about 20 minutes or so. See you guys when we get done. All right guys, look at our pizza roll snacks that we made. I'm so excited to go ahead and try one. Which one should I try? Let's get this one. Look at that. And like I said, the sauce that I put on top, you can, that's optional. You can put it after it comes out the oven or you can make it a dipping sauce or you can do both. I'm just gonna, ooh, hoo -hoo, look at that. Mm. Now that's good. Kids are gonna love you for this. Grandkids are gonna love you for this. Quick and easy, you can knock it out. I'm gonna finish this, y'all. I'll see y'all next time.